Hi Artis and Tony, my name's Frank, and this is the best 3D print in the world. Another 3D printer. This is a Prusa i3 box frame RepRap 3D printer. RepRap stands for self-replicating rapid prototyping machine, I think. My RepRap in particular was printed by a gentleman in England and shipped to me in Texas. I will, once completed with this uh, project, I'll be able to print things, including another 3D printer, which I've got some aluminum T-slot for right now, along with my soldering iron. Um, <laughs> my printer is a little bit different than most of the uh, Prusa i3 box frames. It's got a little bit more Z travel. That's the up and down. Um, and I made it out of what I just had lying around. Um, but yeah, it's uh, pretty cool stuff. I'm also using 0.9 degree motors instead of the traditional 1.8 degree motors, uh, stepper motors. So hopefully uh, once I've got this thing running and uh, all the electronics on it, it'll be pretty awesome and be able to do really high quality prints. Um, the only criticism I can have for the RepRap project and the RepRap uh, printers is that they are all designed around metric um, hardware standards. It's like these are 8mm smooth rods, this is a 5mm threaded rod, um, you know, down here we've got more 5mm, or sorry, this is a 7mm threaded rod, and to the side we've got some 8mm threaded rod. But the fastener hardware, like the screws and whatnot, they're of all different sizes. I've got some 4mm, um, some 3mm going on, I've also got some, uh, no, these are all the 3mm, but those should be more. Um, that's just what I had lying around, that was long enough. So it's it's kind of annoying just getting a hold of all the bolt sizes here in the States. So uh, a standard American sizing would be nice, but it the RepRap project is very global, so you can definitely find a metric in the US. I don't know if they can find American standards in Europe. But yeah, a 3D printer is the best 3D print.